A shootout occurred at around midnight on Saturday on Mirage Road in Ladyville. The exchange of gunfire left three persons injured and one man dead. According to police, a trio of men opened fire upon a group of four men. 44-year-old Lyndon Gillett, 23-year-old Casey Lozano, and Terrence Flowers were all injured during the crossfire. Lionel Ramdas died on the scene. Assistant Commissioner of Police Edward Broster briefed the media on the incident. Ladyville Police is investigating the uh, shooting death of Mr. Lionel Ramdas. Early on Saturday morning at about 12.30 a.m., whilst our police was patrolling on Mirage Road, they heard what appeared to be gunshots and saw several individuals running. They immediately pers pursued some individuals that were firing shots who then ran into the premises of Ms. Cynthia Lozano. They encountered a male person on Mirage Road whom appeared to be deceased with a firearm beside him. The initial investigation revealed that there were four men in the premises of Ms. Lozano socializing. When we had two gunmen coming from the rear of the building and one from the front and ambushed the gentlemen who were at the picnic table socializing. Uh, after which they ran on Mirage Road. Police believe that the shooting is a retaliation of the murder of Rene Chavaria, who was gunned down in that same area which occurred about three months ago. The home where the men were attacked on Saturday night was previously riddled with bullets about a month ago. Police believes that a person who hangs out at the house was involved with Chavaria's death. Police are trying to figure out if Ramdas associates shot him while firing at the opposing team or if he was hit by the opposing group. We're investigating this shooting from two angles. We believe that The gunmen, after firing shots in the premises, chased Lozano and Terence Flowers. And we believe that someone from the premises fired the fatal shot, may have fired the fatal shot that uh, fatally wounded Lionel Ramdas in defense of the two other fleeing victims as well as it could have been it could have been friendly fire from the gunman who was doing the shooting the other two suspects that we believe and that are person of interest to us is darwin darwin estrado and egbert baldwin Police have two persons they are looking for, who they believe are the two remaining gunmen. Police recovered one handgun on the scene, which laid next to the body of Ramdas. On the scene, we recovered 20 expended shells and two live rounds, along with the firearm, as I mentioned earlier, a Arcos brand with serial number 26KR500660 along with one magazine with nine live rooms and that firearm was cut already as if though it was being fired uh, the firearm has been processed and sent to the firearm expert for analysis ramdas's death is the fourth to occur in that area of ladyville within a four month period 